Amateurs in boxing, of course, Agus Klimas. Agus, um, any updates on the big potential fight between Lomachenko and George Kambosos? Nothing I can say because uh, everything is in talks and talks and talks. Same thing, Kusik, Joshua, uh, we know already a few have stepped out. So uh, we're going to be negotiating, but nothing confirmed. Absolutely, just everyday talks. What from your uh, side can you say happened exactly with Fury? Um, you know, there was talks. Well, he, had, he had yeah. to fight a mandatory. Uh -huh. So that's what, you know, the WBC ordered uh, uh, the first bid. And uh, top rank won a first bid, and right now we're promoting a fight. And I believe uh, we got the date April 23rd mm -hmm. in the uh, in UK. That's gonna go on a uh, Sky pay per view. Was there any uh, you know feelings of, of disappointment by Alexander that he wasn't able to to get that undisputed fight, and and now it's no, yeah, no, no, yeah. not at all. Alexander, he knows exactly what he's doing. Uh, plus. You know, we are uh, gentlemen because you know, we signed a contract before the Joshua fight. We made the deal, so it's absolutely nothing, uh, nothing strange. Do you see that second fight being more dominant for Alexander than the first fight, which he clearly won? But... Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, uh, depends. You know, Joshua has a new trainer, and nobody knows who the trainer, the trainer is. And, uh, no. They're probably going to try to get more time to buy for the training, so we're going to step in the fight, maybe sometimes, I want to say, June. Um, well, Alexander is going to be preparing for the fight too, so... Right, and uh, just again for Lomachenko, he tweeted today that the offer sent, you know, to, to Cambosi. Is that correct? There is an offer on the table that's awaiting, you know, approval or disapproval for Cambosi. Negotiation. Negotiations, yes. Some some offer uh, from a top rank was they talking with Lou Bella, who is a uh, Cambosos promoter, and uh, you know that's uh, Lou Bella's uh, job to deliver that offer to George and uh, to, to negotiate about the fight. What other fights do you think makes sense if uh, Cambosos uh, the fight that fight doesn't materialize? If uh, Lomachenko is not yeah. going to happen. Uh, well, there is a few names, but I think uh, probably the most what they would like to do, or you know, uh, that's a Dave, uh, Devin Haney. The Haney fight could be a realistic option. Yeah, yeah, I would say so. I would say so. Other than uh, Garcia is fighting already somewhere. Uh, I believe uh, Tank Dave is also is scheduled to fight. So. And, and just lastly, what, what's the biggest obstacle? to making those fights happen, Haney and Davis, which which one is more realistic that the fans might actually get? I believe uh, you're talking about the Loma? Yeah, for Loma. Yeah, like yeah. We know yeah. fight. Yeah, I think, that, but... I think it would be much easier to get uh, Haney's fight done than, than, than uh, Tank Davis. But who knows, you know, uh, if, if everything going to go by the, you know, by the what the plans are or Everything supposed to go. Maybe a like big, huge unification with, with Davis also can be done. If, if the fight, if uh, Australia is a sticker for Cambosis, is that fine? You think with Lomachenko, he'll go to Australia for that fight? Go. Oh, even we'll go to prepare for the fight there. And I told you know, and I told the top rank and the, and the, and the Cambosis as people know, if uh, we're gonna make that fight happen, Loma. Loma doesn't live in the United States. He comes to the United States to prepare for the fight. So if we're gonna be fighting in Australia, with the global things happening nowadays, uh, most likely, we not most likely, we will go to Australia for two months, prepare for the fight. Even if a country is gonna be closed, we're already there. So we don't have to go back and forth. Thanks for your time, Igor. No problem. And, uh, yeah, congrats always on your success. Thank you. Thank you.